What are some places where no children should be allowed? Stop bringing children into my bar and complaining that I swear. It's a fucking bar. Reddit. The bar I work at, but people are shocked when they can't bring their kids with them. Beauty pageants. Social media. Strip club. The 9 p.m. screening of Avatar at my local cinema last Friday night. Most of the internet. Just had a baby crying in the movie theater like it was his religion. The apartment above mine. The Duggars family home. Snapchat and TikTok. Strip clubs. Child free weddings. Are rated late movies on school nights. Gambling establishments. R. Kelly's house. Sweatshop. My teams in PvP. War. Live theater performances. Until your kid learns how to not talk and scream over performers, get a babysitter. Only fans. The dog park. Weddings where they say adults only or no children. When they put that on the invitation they're putting it there for a fucking reason. It doesn't mean no children except for yours unless they tell you specifically it's okay of course. Beauty pageants. Instagram and TikTok. A Nambla convention. Recently took my kid to Vegas because I have family that live nearby. We all took our kids to the strip because there's a bunch of family-friendly activities there now. My daughter kept pointing out all the smokers and drinking and half-naked showgirls and I thought no, in the asshole, this is supposed to be the place for adults to come and have fun. I saw a teenager bring her newborn infant I heard her bragging about it had been less than a month, in between Metallica and White Snake songs into a bowling alley on rock night and I never wanted to punch a teenager more than I did that night. Ah. I also heard an infant crying in a 4x4 driven by a drunkard that was out deliberately disturbing a campsite at 2 a.m. on a Wednesday once. I would like to have punched those people in the throat, too. I guess children shouldn't be allowed with stupid teenagers with no direction, or obnoxious drunks. A white van. My basement. A factory. A rave. Social media. Beauty contests. For real, it's creepy. The house of a politician. Casinos. In my way when I'm trying to sprint. Fremont Street in Las Vegas. Alone in a room getting special attention from a priest, a coach, teachers or any person you even vaguely suspect may be a sexual predator. Thank you. Love. Someone who was allowed in those rooms. Nail salons, fancy restaurants, small children, babies. Coal mines. Anywhere something sexual is occurring. Bars. My house because stuff is really depressing here. The ducking porn store. I can't tell you how many times I have to turn people with three and four year olds away at the one I work at. It's insane. One lady brought her kid in and was like his on a leash. It's ridiculous. I love the sentiment of child free weddings. They don't even understand what's going on, they don't need to be there lol. Around horrible parents. Tick tick. Any drinking parties. The amount of times people have brought their six-month-old child to a drinking party is insane dizzy face hashtag dizzy. Movie theaters. Unless the kid can actually shut the fuck up for 1.52 hours, don't bring M. 4chan. Las Vegas. I work for a major hotel on the strip and see PPL bringing their small kids and babies all the time. There is literally nothing for them to do here. In prison. Reddit D. Bars, wineries, 
Upscale restaurants. Any place where there's fighting and abuse. Chinese chain production industry. Mines. Wars. Strip club. On an seldom used app commonly known as Snapchat, nothing good will come. The department stores where they sell fragile glass things. Cults. I grew up in a mega cult and was forced to attend. I tried to make it obvious I didn't want to be there to the people working in the kids' learning area. It was hell. Breweries that don't serve food. Literally no reason for your kid to be there. I have three kids. They stay at home. Near anything bar bar fridge, sound bar. Sex toy stores. I worked at one for years. Sign on the door said must be 18 to enter. We carded. The number of people who tried to bring their small kids in oh they're too young to understand remember was way too high. Vegas. The fact they try to make it family friendly at one point is ridiculous. If you must take your kids, stay at Nasty Circus Circus or Excalibur. I don't want anybody's kids witnessing the debauchery that is Vegas. Frat House. Climbing gyms. I have had three close calls of nearly crushing a child because parents think it is some big play area that kids can just run around, and don't realize that an adult falling six feet from a root could seriously hurt a child. Airplanes. Make them swim. Vegas. People need to stop. My uterus. My uncle's house. Steel mill. They lack the experience and frankly it's just a safety hazard. Alone with a priest. American schools. Churches. Tattoo shops don't bring your kid with you when you're getting a tattoo, we're not going to look after them and no, they can't just sit in a corner with an iPad. In a place where adults are drinking and or partaking in drug use. It is very scary for children to see the adults who are supposed to care for them not be able to do so. Also, courtrooms or police stations. Don't use your kids as a pawn in your divorce games. Don't make adult problems children's problems. Prison. Bars. Alas. Church. As Dan Savage repeatedly notes, if kids got raped by clowns as often as they get raped by priests it would be against the law to take your kids to the circus. On your Facebook feed. Morda. It is the realm and base of Sauron. It lay to the east of Gonda and the great river Anduin, and to the south of Mirkwood. Parents' bedrooms before 730. Nice restaurants.